Hey guys, how you doing? My name is Rich Guzman. Hi guys, I'm Anastasia Holders, aka Coach Ace. And welcome to Ace and Rich Freedom by Design. Guys, this is episode five, Real Talk with Ace and Rich. It's all about the hot seat, right? Today is all about the hot seat, where we help answer your questions with marketing. So if you're brand new and this is the first time you come here, leave a comment in the actual comment here in Facebook and let us know this is your first time. If not, that's all right too. We love you guys too, right? So. Uh, you did it again, hon. You left out the volume open again on the other computer. Well, it is live, and it's on stage, so <laughs> shit will happen. Shit will happen. <laughs> so, guys, and if you're watching us here on YouTube, be sure to comment, like, and subscribe. And don't forget to click on the notification bell so you don't miss the beat when we go live and create this valuable content just for you. So now we're ready to get started. Let me find out who is uh, here with us today. That's right. Let me head on over to the uh, Facebook over here. And we welcome all of our new guests and visitors here. And if you guys are seeing us live also within a Facebook group community um, that we are a part of, um, maybe you're on our team. OK, be sure to click the play button on this video that you are watching it in the timeline in order for us to see your questions in the thread. So make sure you click the play button. It'll bring you over to our fan page over here at AR Freedom by Design. And we'll go ahead and answer your questions. What's up, Eugene Rodriguez? Welcome to the live. And Mark and Dana Brown, welcome to the live. Lamar Show, welcome to the live. Mandy, Ida, Josh, All DeMarco. Hi, right. hey, Josh. Hey, what's happening? Welcome to the live. Adam e. Shelton is just blowing it up. Woo! Yes. And hey, mom, how, how you doing? Hi. Your mom's becoming regular lately. I'll tell you, you know what I like to say every time I see our, our clients and students actually having success? Yeah. Our babies are growing up. Our babies are growing up. I love it. I love it. I love it. Uh, and pretty soon they're going to taste that freedom. Oh, yeah. Oh, man. I, I can taste it in the air. It's so sweet. Yes, yes. Guys, trust me. <laughs> you're going to enjoy your freedom when you get caught by Anderson Ranch, okay? Yes. Uh, let's see here. Who Donald Candies. Donald Candies, what's up? Nice to see you. Good to see you. Welcome back to the hot seat. Donald, you know, Donald has grown since he's been coming to the hot seat. Oh, absolutely. absolutely. You know, I love that. When people just come to the hot seat, you know, they, they know that central place that you can come to to ask questions about safe marketing. Place. It's a safe it's place. It's a safe and central place that you can come to. A great resource for all you guys and for your teammates. I mean, look we're all here to learn and work together right we're here to strive for the same common goal right That's and right. what's that goal freedom baby freedom by design freedom yes. by design <laughs> That's right. and it's by your own design this is why we put freedom by design because freedom by design means uh you know a lot of things for different people okay so it's all about creating your own freedom by design okay so now who we got tracy lee and uh demarco what's happening baby Let's see. Uh, we got David William Toomey. And the list goes on and on. We got more people hopping on right now. So well, keep that down so that way I can let's see I got my phone get here too. started. Let's go. So, guys, this is how it works. If you've been struggling with your online marketing efforts, if you've been trying to build your own website, maybe you're trying to drive traffic but don't really understand the mechanics, right? The fundamentals of internet marketing. Yes. This is where we come in. And you could come and this ask is the foundation. your mentor. This is the beginning. That's right. Beginning of the journey. Right. Now, why is it that me and Rich, you know, are doing this for free? Like, th this is a good question. Like, why are we doing this for free? I mean, well, we should because, be charging, right? Well, you know, here's the thing. The reason why, you know, I remember coming to you and I said, I said, you know, when I first got started in internet marketing, because you came from network marketing. Yes. And I remember telling you that um, I was very frustrated when I first got started. I had so many so questions. Was so was I. Right. But yeah, but you got me. I, you know, I was coaching you. I, I know. But before you even came in my life, let me tell yeah. you something. No, I had no, network but, marketing upline that would not answer my questions. Right. Right. But what we're talking about is online here. Yeah. Online. So yeah. the thing about this, guys, <laughs> is that when you, uh, you know, reach out and you have questions and nobody's there to answer the questions, yes. it can get very frustrating. And then you feel like you're alone in business. It sucks. And it sucks. it sucks. It really does suck because I've been there. <laughs> so if you're brand new and you're br and you're like, man, what do I do? Where do I go from here? This is why the Hasi was created in the first place. Yes. It started out as beer and chocolate. He would have a beer and I would eat some Kit Kats. <laughs> yes. Now it's all about beer and coffee. <laughs> That's Star and now it's Starbucks. That. It's Starbucks. Right. And I'm, I'm telling you, Rich, you know, what I find about this community is that, you know, as it continues to grow, you know, over the years, I mean, there's there's more people than actually BCI that come to hospital. Yes. But a lot of people, you know, they still have jobs. They're still well, working. And then during these hours, you know, some of them will catch it live. Some of them will watch the replay, yep, yep. which we also love our replayers. We love our replayers, you know, but we also want to encourage our replayers also 
whether you're not in a you know a different time zone and I understand and things like that. But don't forget to ask your questions because you can always watch the replay and you can see the answer. Yes, right? absolutely. Don't let that stop absolutely. you. Absolutely. I don't care if you're in Guam. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Where, where did Guam come from? Hey, um, hey, we get, that, we that, was the, Guam. that was the first, like, the person that came to mind for some reason. Guam, because I, I talked to people in Guam. I know. Yeah, I, I know. talked to everybody. I social network with any damn body. It don't matter me. <laughs> President Obama, ex former Obama, don't matter. <laughs> Donald Trump, I don't care. <laughs> <laughs> now the birds. <laughs> <laughs> that was good. That was All super right. good. Dude, that so was guys, awesome. So, guys, <laughs> um, it's time right now for you guys to bring out your questions and ask any questions that you have on yes. marketing. What are you stuck on? What are you what stuck is, on? What do you want to know? What is pissing you off that you're trying to figure out something you can't figure out? What's that one monkey right? on you know your back? I mean? it's, it's <laughs> unbelievable, right? What's that one monkey on your back? You know, that always saw that monkey. The monkey on the back, The huh? bad monkey, you know, that little chimpanzee, that yeah. monkey that's always holding us back, keeping us from being successful. You know that monkey on your back I'm talking about? Well, that's where personal development comes in, you know yeah. what I mean? And, you know, like, I'm always listening to personal development. What was I listening to last night, my dear? Uh, Proctor. In the evening, right before I went to bed. Yeah, and it right? was so good because I was sleeping to it. And yeah. you know what's great about listening to personal development as you're going to sleep? It's good because it gets into your subconscious. And then when you wake up in the morning, you feel refreshed and you feel so good. You're like, wow, you know what? I feel good for some reason. And it's because you listen to the personal development audio yes. before at the time you were in your slumber. Mm -hmm. And as you go into your slumber, that's when your mind is like, even though you're in a dream state, Yes. And you're hitting that unconscious level. It's still getting into your subconscious. It's an amazing way. And you taught me that. Yep. Yeah. Yep. And, and it helps me so much. Mm -hmm. That's why I'm fired up today. Yes. Um, you know, because for, for us, we like to bring out the leadership. We like to teach leadership. Absolutely. Okay. Yes. Um, you know, we're not free for nothing. All right. That's right. We're not like, you know, uh, free with, you know, from our bosses, our jobs. No. We work very hard to get to this point. Yes. Uh, but, you know, it's always about giving back. You know what I know? No, no, yeah. We're both wearing white shirts. That's the first time I ever seen us in white shirts. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> we're, we're both wearing white today. Yeah, we're both that's wearing nice. white. That's cool. You know, now it's better for them to see my Ace shirt because, you know, sometimes they call you Ace. They don't even yeah. know it's me. <laughs> okay. So you lost my train of thought here. <laughs> <laughs> Um, I'm just having some fun. While these people think about their questions, you know, can we still wait for them yes. to ask their questions? So when you're thinking about like, um, you know, mm -hmm. how to like really, you know, get that checkup from the neck up, as I always like to say. Yes. Um, you know, Bob Proctor is definitely one of my favorite personal development uh, speakers, Jim Rome, as you know. Um, and, you know, last night was all about the paradigm shift. It was a, um, a replay of the live event. And um, I'm actually... Um, becoming a partner with uh, the Proctor Gallagher Institute. Okay, mm -hmm. So um, I can't wait for that. Um, it's in the works right now. So I'm pretty excited about that. You know, that. nothing but top of the line stuff for us, right, yes. baby? Always about high yes. level value, Absolutely. high level education to help you guys out yes. and just make you a badass yes. marketer Absolutely. on the internet. We, you know, one thing that I like about us is, you know, not only are we working as a couple, but we can put both our minds together. Yes. And, and you know what, if you're a customer of ours and you've been a customer of ours for a long time, we love you and appreciate you. And, you know, and you guys can vouch for this when I say we never market junk. Nope. We may be uh, super affiliates, but we nope. never market junk. Remember nope. that. We market yes. high level education Always. that really truly teaches Boom. you on how yeah to be a marketer because you're watching this video right now and you're probably thinking, I just got started. I'm brand new. I don't know what to do. I don't know where to begin. Right. I just signed up for this, you know, this, this product or this program. Right. And it's like, I'm alone. What do I do? Mm -hmm. Right. That's why the hot seat's for. That's right? right. First question coming in from Adam Shelton says, Q, hey, Ace Rich. I remember you talking about having a great desktop computer. Could you give me the information on that? Oh, you need a recommendation for a good desktop computer. We're supposed to get together today and have a conversation. And when we do, I will share the goods with you. Okay, okay. All right. But what if somebody is looking for it? I mean, do they have to wait? Well, to I mean, it? if they're looking for a computer, somebody else pop up and let me know. Yeah. We'll see somebody got to But if it's just um, Adam, what I'm going to do is I'm going to um, spend some little time with him and uh, give him some good stuff. Okay, all right, awesome. Mike Scaduto. Hey, Mike, good to see you. We have an appointment right. this evening, me and him. Awesome. Yep. All right, cool. Anybody else got some questions? Let's go. Come on now. We are here. Yes, definitely. Uh, hey, Mike Scudo, welcome to the live. Cool, cool, cool. So, guys, um, when it comes to actually um, understanding personal development, when it comes to understanding your mindset, it's not just about learning the mindset stuff. 
It's about really applying what you're learning and understanding what you're learning when it comes to mindset. Because a lot of people, what they do is they just, they, you know, they get all this mindset information oh, and gosh. they get, uh, they get juiced up, they get pumped up. And I like to call it, it's like inflated. No, it's what like, they do is they buy a bunch of books it, and they like, like my bookends. Right, but it's like, they don't it, it's, use them. it's they don't like, read them. it's like being inflated. Yes. And when, when it's inflated, it's mm -hmm. not real. It's not sustainable. It only lasts short term and only for so long. Okay. Yes. So when you want to sustain yourself for life, okay. Um, you know, I created an email today that was really got a great response rate. And if you're on my list, uh, you would have actually heard it. Um, the title says, um, you know, is this your last sunset? Okay. Well, Rich, listen, I know uh, you're on a roll here about that, uh, but what is on the agenda here is we got Mike Scaduto that says, I'm still waiting to hear about which external drive for my laptop. All right. Uh, external drive, uh, that would be a Western digital external, my book drive, but get a desktop drive because they last a lot longer and it's a 72 RPM, which means it transfer files faster. Okay. That's something I couldn't type up. Yeah. <laughs> you had to come in the hot seat and remind him on that just one, Mike. Mike, Mike, <laughs> just, Mike, just go to Best Buy, type in on um, a Western Digital, uh, My Book Desktop External Drive. There you go. And you'll see it. Don't get the small ones. They break down all the time. I can't tell you how many times I've seen those break down. Mark and Dana Brown says, I like the info on a good desktop computer also. Been searching for a few weeks now. Okay, well, since you all want to know about that, then I'm going to go into my trusty little computer here. You see, that's what it takes to get Rich to actually release information publicly. If there's more than one person that needs the answer, we're going to go ahead into the screen and go looking for it. <laughs> oh, boy, I see Black Friday in July. Let's say I'm going shopping today. Oh, snap. Best Buy has a Black Friday in July sale. Yeah. Oh, on. that done did it now. <laughs> Hold on, I, I need to. I heard of Christmas in July, but damn, Black Friday in July? What is going on with the retailers? <laughs> All right, so what I usually do, guys, is let me go to the share screen. All right. So Mike says desktop, even though it's for his laptop, to use the WD. Yes, because you plug it in, man. You get a lot mm. more speed, you get a lot more power, mm. and it's and it lasts a lot longer. And plus, you get more size for your dollar. If you get with those small ones, you'll pay more. Not only that, but there's it doesn't last as long. Former D squad over here, guys. Trust me, I have people come to me all the time with those issues. There you go. So I'm just helping you guys out. Yeah, you come to hot seat. You got questions about computers, even now. I want to I want to <laughs> say something, and it goes against the grain because when I was working at um at Best Buy's Geek Squad, I remember um people came to me for recommendations for computers because they were hearing it from other people that I was you know recommending great stuff. But what happened was when I was actually, um, you know, giving these recommendations the people on the sales floor was like, well, they don't need this kind of stuff because they're probably not going to use it and things like that. I'm like, no, they might not use everything, but they want performance. They want power. So when they have a, uh, you know, a, a great experience on the internet, mm -hmm. then, you know, it makes sense to them. You mm -hmm. get what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. I can't tell you how many people have come back returning uh, laptops, desktops, and, and 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 coming to me afterwards say rich wow. what do you recommend because you know the guy on the sales floor recommended this and this thing is slow as a son of a bitch and i said you know what <laughs> not a problem can i leave for a second because you have to ask right so i, I go <laughs> to the floor i said i recommend this gaming computer but i'm not a gamer that's okay but the parts inside here are a lot more high quality so you have a lot more performance Ooh. and speed it'll last you a lot longer and you'll be able to get stuff done like this there you go okay. interesting See? so how do i know because i built my computers from scratch so you don't have to be a gamer to get a gaming computer as long as you are looking for that performance yes a gaming computer desktop would be the best recommendation yeah, yeah. Top so of what, line, best what recommendation. i do is i go to uh, desktop. And it's budget friendly too actually yeah what i do is i go to um let me just type in gaming pc so if i go gaming pc in the search you guys can do the same thing okay i'm gonna go to gaming desktops and the ones that i choose all right, I'm gonna scroll down here. I wanna make sure I get the right manufacturers, okay? See right here? You have a lot of information here. Don't let this overwhelm you, okay guys? But follow along. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna choose what's on sale, mm -hmm. okay? I'm gonna choose Cyber Power, I Buy Power, those are the only two that I'm going to choose. I buy power and cyber power. And then what I'm going to do is I am going to go a little bit lower right here. And to get something decent, you want to do 750, 999, 9999, right? 
you want to make sure you spend a little bit so that way you're not spending something that's too cheap that you're going to be back in best buy in a couple of years you don't want to do that okay so the next thing we're going to do is we're going to choose 16 gigabytes why because windows 10 requires it i don't care what anybody says you need 16 gigs of memory for that all right the next thing is i choose intel not amd why because intel is a stronger processor it runs cooler and it lasts longer and i've had my other computer that i built for over 10 years and we're still using it and ace is using it right oh I baby sure is your computer fast or is your computer fast oh i love it super right? fast yes i built that 10 years ago guys so i know what i'm talking about <laughs> so now we're going to look and see what sales we got right so we got some 999s 999s let's look at the processor all right down here this should be a section for the processor. I like to choose um, gaming PCs, Intel i5. Okay. Now you could choose um, i7. You don't need it. You really do not need it. Okay. Now, if you got a sale for 729, that's really good. Unfortunately, that only has eight gigs, but I would just tell Geek Squad to upgrade it to 16 gigs. Okay. That's what I would do. So if you get a steal like that, let me see the one that I'm the one that I'm picking. Let me see here. Got another one over here, seven forty nine. They got some good sales, guys. Good sales. I would go with this one, and I'll put it right in the chat. All right. There's one right there. And where's my other one that I saw at the top here? Let's see. There we go, right there. Here's the second one. For the price, you're getting a lot. But just tell Geek Squad to upgrade to 16 gigs. If they tell you don't need it, tell them I don't care what you think. I want 16 gigs. Okay? Yeah. Because they'll try to talk you out of stuff sometimes. All right, so there you go. My two recommendations for a PC to get your business off the ground and get running. Trust me, you will love it, okay? Now, if you wanna spend a little bit more, you can do that and you'll get probably um, a little more stuff. But if you, if you spend a little more guys, make sure it's an i7, not an i5 processor, okay? If you're paying more, make sure it's an i7. If it's not an i7, you can get away with what I just showed you. Okay, cool. Let's get back to the screen here. All right. Um, I have a question from, actually came through a private message. It was in our batch hour, okay. actually. And okay, it was cool. posted after hours. Because, you know, we run batch hour for our MTIs and all-in members and uh, Power Lee System. And they are granted this batch hour that we do where we answer all their questions between 5 and 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time okay. inside that group. So because it's Friday, we don't do batch hours on Friday. We have them come over here. So this is a question from Lilia Summers. And she asks, how do I see my top fans in Facebook? Wow. You want to know who your top fans are. The best thing to do is head over to your Facebook business page and actually click on the actual name title that says top fan next to that person. And what it will do is show you your top fans. That's how I'm able to see them. And there's pretty much nothing much you can do. But if you want to recognize them, they will come on like some kind of leaderboard like appearance inside your Facebook business page. Mm -hmm. So when you click on top fan, it'll show you the names of the people and it'll also show you like how current are they as top fans and how engaged they are. So when you see them, uh, yeah, you can do like a post. I mean, I would do a post and, you know, or in your video when you go live, you know, give them some kind of acknowledgement and say thank you. Awesome. Mm -hmm. All right. Cool. And we got top fans over here because, you know, we love y'all. Thank you. Uh, top fans. What's up, <laughs> top fans awesome. in the house? <laughs> okay, so let's see any more questions here. Uh, let me just step back up there. Ooh, a lot more questions. Okay, okay, so Ida says, Q, beginner question. How do you and your affiliate link – oh, how do you add your affiliate link in a Facebook post? In a Facebook post? Yeah. Okay. First of all, um, this is a very good question, and I understand it's coming from a beginner's perspective. So all beginners, please pay attention. Do not post links in your profile. 
In your post. In your post profile. Post. Yeah. Don't do it from your profile. Do it actually from your Facebook group or your Facebook business page. You have a lot more leverage that way. And then sharing it to your timeline versus you having to go out there and Facebook's algorithm sees you posting links in your profile. I don't care who is watching this live and says, well, I've been doing it and it seems to be working out for me. Well, good for you because guess what? You are on algorithm shit list. Okay, I've been reading about the algorithm and Facebook doesn't want people posting links directly on their Facebook. Okay, because what happens is your engagement is going to go down. Your edge rate is going to go down and your Facebook following. They will not see your posts because Facebook won't even give you the time of day. This is why Rich and, and, and myself have high engagement. And when we look at our numbers, we can see we have high engagement because we're always posting on our Facebook business page, which is branded to us. And then whatever links we put in there, we share it to our timeline so that it still has the Facebook URL mask. And then Facebook keeps it right inside Facebook. You get what I'm trying to say to you guys? Exactly. Keep it within Facebook so that Facebook doesn't see that they're leaving Facebook. Facebook doesn't want them uh, to let you bring people away from Facebook. They want to keep them in Facebook as long as possible. Yes. So you want to keep Facebook to Facebook. That's the best way to do it. So don't put links in your profile and don't put them on your post. Put it on your Facebook business page or your group. I agree. Yeah. Cool. Things are changing. Yes, Things are changing. Yes, the algorithm yes. for 2019 is not the same as the it was algorithm has changed over the years. Man, no doubt they about are that. getting so strict. Yes, they are. You better check it out. Look up. Well, the because they want to um, make sure that they they're, they're serving their customers yeah. with a lot of value and they do. You know, really good, high quality. Yes, um, and they don't want anything misleading or anything about make money online or network marketing. I mean, they are cracking down. So, guys, whatever you've been doing the last five, six years, the same. It's time to change it up and start abiding by the Facebook policy and rules because marketers are being affected. This is why they want to encourage you and they make it even difficult for marketers and they're trying to actually get you to do Facebook ads because yep. then you put all the links you want. But as long as you got your demographics and you got everything dialed in correctly, they're making money off of you, but you are a business. And that's the thing. You got to stick by their policy. Hey, Misha, what's up? Welcome to the live. Hey, hey, Misha. What's up? There's one of our mentors right there. Hey, Misha. That's right. Next question. Very good question, actually. I like that question. Yeah, it's a great question. I love questions like that. Cool. Um, I know that uh, Mark and Dana Brown asked for what monitor, so I'm just going to put it right here in the chat. A monitor? Yep. Boy, are we shopping today? <laughs> yep. So I'm going to put that there. Uh, it's, a great, it's a great sale. Yeah. One, uh, one, is it a great sale? No. It's not, but it's a good price for 27 inch. So there we go. Right there. Boom. That's one we have. Okay. Um, Ace uses this monitor, and it rocks. Yeah, it really does. I, yeah. I like it. Definitely. They'll make they'll make great monitors. Ever since I went to a big monitor, I don't go back to the little tinty winty tiny ones. <laughs> yep. Yeah. So, anyways, yeah. um Mandy says, Can more you questions? can you do a screen share of that ace of the top fan thing? Yeah, we could do it. Sure. Let's, Let's do, do it. it. All right. Let's get to the share screen. Okay. Now you guys know I have to take Rich's mouse from him, and that's kind of no, you don't. Do I? You know how to do it? No, you don't. No, you're going to walk me through it. Oh, I'm going to walk you through it. Yep. Okay, because he got the mouse. See, I'm new at what she's talking about. I don't know this stuff. I do all yeah. this types of marketing. <laughs> so this will be good as a case study to see, like, how easy it is. Okay? Rich Guzman doesn't understand Facebook like me. <laughs> this is true. Okay, go ahead. Okay. So when you want to see your top fans, Rich, what you want to do is pull up the top fans. So... Uh, we need to find a top fan. Okay. So okay. let's go to, uh, let's see here. Find somebody with a top right fan. Okay. Click on that. You see the diamond? Yep. Okay. Everybody sees this. See all top fans. Click on that. Oh, that's easy. And give it a few minutes and it's going to come up. There's all our top fans right there. See? Nice. It comes right up. If you want to see all, click on see all top fans. Bam. And cool. that's just within the current. Yeah. See, it says new top fan, top fan for two weeks. Two weeks ago, three weeks ago, you get to see all these names oh, and profile. Cool. Yeah. Now, guys, how easy was that? <laughs> how easy was that? That was it. So, do you see how like I just was instructed on how to do That's that? It. Yeah. I never done that. <laughs> I never done that before. So, I'm the whole. And I, this is I'm the, the only guy that does other stuff on the market. You marketing. don't give badges to top fans. They earn them. So top fans are created through Facebook algorithm and they give them badges based on their engagement. So the more people that show up to hot seat, the more people that engage, ask questions, the more people that comment, not short itty bitty three word comments like, wow, I'm talking about like, hello, use your brain, talk. Okay? <laughs> they want to see that kind of engagement. 
Oh, they're going to give you so many great brownie points. They're going to make you a top fan. Now, to some people, they don't care about top fans. But to other people who are actually admins that spend time to create the content to put on their Facebook business pages, we reward those who become top fans. So the more that you actually engage, you show up, you come to your, your Facebook lives and even not just ours, but what about other people's Facebook lives that you're following yep. and seeing first? You have to click the button so you can see first in your newsfeed when those people are yes. going live so you can get that notification. And when you show up, you become their top fan too. Exactly. There you go. Right on. <laughs> okay. So who we got here next? All right. When it comes to Facebook, that's me. It's social well, networking. You know, I, I love I, I'm Facebook. I'm old school Facebook. Yeah. yeah oh, from God, back in 2008, <laughs> when it was the wild, wild west. Oh, gosh. When there weren't all these algorithm changes and stuff like that. <laughs> that's when I moved over and learned um, solo ass from Misha. I yes. said, thank you, Misha, for making my life so simple. <laughs> yeah. You know? So Mandy says, so if we don't see a badge anywhere, no top fans anywhere, um, probably you don't have enough people on your uh, Facebook business page to become a top fan, especially with that. You have to yes. take that into consideration. Yes. Yes. You have to be consistent with your Facebook lives, my dear. And you got to make sure that those people are digesting your content. If they're not digesting your content, you ain't going to have any top fans. That's true. Yes. Got to give the goods. Make it juicy. <laughs> juicy. Juicy. Okay. Next uh, let's question. see. So, do, 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 do. <laughs> Mark, Mark Brown says, yes, thanks. I need a new computer. I'm glad All you right. guys are getting a new computer because yes. it will stop you from being productive. Right. Trust me. So, Get that computer I recommended, and if you go a little bit more, tell them make sure it's an i7 if you spend a little bit more. If you spend a little bit more, don't get an i5. It's not worth it. You can get an i7, which is even faster, but the i5 is good enough for what you need. But make sure you tell them to upgrade to 16 gigs, even if it's 8 gigs. And if they say you don't need it, say, shut up, take my money, and just take care of it. Okay? Charles, uh, if, if I mess up your name, I apologize. I think it's LeCoff, so I'm going to say it very gently like yep. that. Charles Lakoff just joined us on the live. Welcome to the hot seat. Hey, Charles, welcome to the hot seat. And if it's your first time here, welcome. It's a great family. Yes. And if you have any questions about marketing online, let us know. Yep. Uh, okay. Market Data Brown says, so how the heck do you become a top fan? We engage, we create, we show up, but no top fan. Well, you're not going to know about that until Facebook actually says to you, hey, congratulations, you just became a top fan. Claim your badge. See, uh -huh. that's how it happens. They I actually, did not know that. Yeah, they pop it right up in your news feed. How do you remember say, all this stuff? <laughs> the Facebook marketing. She's a Facebook marketing queen over here. I'm telling yes, you. I am. I'm gonna, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to go to the store. I'm going to get a, like, a, like a crown. Oh, no, please. And we're going to do like a Facebook live segment one day. I'm going to be like, dun, 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 dun. I'm gonna be like, welcome, Facebook marketing what queen. A Facebook sash, right? It's a Facebook queen, <laughs> Okay, so that's how you actually do it. When you become a top fan, you have to claim your badge. Wow. Okay, Eugenio says, from now on, whenever I go shopping, I'm going to contact Ace and Rich first. You do that. You do that yeah. because we're all about actually working our businesses on a budget. And if you got a budget and you're trying to get the best, you know, the best top of the line tools, you know, resources, equipment to run your online marketing business. I mean, let's let's face it. We all going to be mar be able to buy all this stuff anyway. But why buy junk when you can buy stuff that's going to give you high performance and it's the high quality to give you the best results, right? Now, Adam says, uh, Facebook queen, Lady Boss Ace. Yeah, Lady Boss Ace. Thank you. Mandy <laughs> <laughs> uh, says, uh, wait a minute. Hold on. Go up. That just went. It Go, just, oh. We're trying to answer the questions as fast as we can, but, but it goes, like yeah, it goes up. Yeah. It's pushing it down and been pushing it up. Okay. So where do you want to go? Uh, let's see. Scroll down. There you go. Manny, OMG, I upgraded to a top of the line Dell laptop, and it has made a huge difference for me. You recommended her that that, that laptop. Yeah, I mean, you were looking for a laptop because you said you're going to move yeah. around and stuff. If you're going to be traveling a lot and mm -hmm. stuff, laptops are great. Mm -hmm. But honestly, guys, if you're going to be home, get a get a desktop. It's a workhorse. It lasts longer and it's faster. Yeah, because when we travel and we do speaking engagements and things like that. Yeah, I say, have my laptop right they'll here. They'll bring guys. the laptop. Yeah, I have But my that's when like, right we here. travel and we actually are like on the beach, working from the beach or we're working, you know, yeah. full side or something like that. I have, or three, the hotel. I have three desktops here. <laughs> you ain't going to bring your desktop with uh, you. <laughs> no, but, but, but I'm just saying, yeah. though. You know, when you're working from home, yeah. you know, you have an office. Yes. Have that desktop with your monitor and, yes. you know, treat yourself, you know, yes. get something nice. And it's an so, office. So yeah. that way when you're working, you're you're moving and shaking and things are smooth and you're yes. not worried about like, oh, God, it's a full flow. It's driving <laughs> you insane. I can't stand it. 
No, you know, I can never get anything get done. I, I would freak old. out. People came to me. I can't tell how many times people came to me who were like, oh my God, Rich, this computer's slow. Please help me. I'm like, well, first of all, let's see what you got. Oh God, you got an i3? Oh, that's horrible. Oh, AMD? Oh, oh A5 uh, or A6? Oh, that's horrible. What are you doing? Get an i5 minimum. Get 16 gigs there on your you computer. Go. Yes. You know, Windows 10 requires it to run the way it's supposed to. So there's enough for it. <laughs> Lamar says desktops are twice the performance and half the price. That's right. You yes. got it. All right. Let's see. Any uh, one else? more here we missed. How many solo ad vendors you test at any given time? Solo ad marketing, Rich? Depends on how many clicks I want to do that week. So if I'm first getting started and I want to do like the minimum numbers I like to do is a thousand and two thousand clicks a week. Um, that's minimum, right? So um, that's a good ratio to start at. But I would take different vendors. So if you test with, you know, let's say five vendors, six vendors, and you do about like 300 to 500 clicks and you're adding up to a thousand clicks. There you go. There it is. But it's all about not how many vendors. It's more how many clicks. It's not Absolutely. about the number of vendors. It's, it's, it's really how many clicks. So the more you spread it out for testing, the better off you're going to be. Uh, minimum testing is 300 clicks. There you go. Don't go Don't go any lower. Are you writing that yeah. down? Everybody took notes? Yeah. See, that's the thing what I'd be telling, I'd be encouraging people to do, yeah. Rich, is when you watch the hot seat, when you guys try to watch like, you know, like let's say you're going to binge watch Ace and Rich's yeah. hot seat and all of our episodes. I mean, I've seen people do that. They'll sit with popcorn yeah. and take a notebook and start writing down all the notes that we answer, yeah. all these questions. They're great questions to ask because people learn a lot when they come here. And I know a lot of people like Donald Candy, he got results just from asking yeah. these questions, you know? So many people like Donald and, and uh, Mark Castile and Adam. I and tell, everybody. it's so funny. I tell people yes. what they need to do mm -hmm. and the majority don't, but yeah. few do. Yeah. Uh, one of the few is Adam Shelton. Adam Shelton, congratulations on your success. Thank you for listening to me. Okay. <laughs> and I'm sure he's thanking me right now. <laughs> There's more. That's what we got to meet tonight. Um, so, and that's like an unannounced thing, but we're going to be meeting tonight. Um, and you know, he's doing amazing. It's because he listens to the training. He listens to the coaching. He listens to, you know, the hot seat. He's coachable. He, he's, coachable. he's coachable. He's coachable. And he takes action yes. on everything yes. that I say. Yes. So if I say, go out there and do a hundred, you know, a thousand to 2000 clicks a week. Yeah, do it. You do it. You do it. You do it. And you start testing That's and you stay right. consistent and you pick off the top from multiple vendors, not just one or two. That's right. You just do it. Right. Cause you want to hit a certain numbers. It's all numbers guys. It's all numbers. Funnels. We got the good funnels. You already know that guy. <laughs> so. All right. Next question is from Josh McDade. All right, Josh. Well, Josh, let me just welcome you to our team. We're really excited to have you here, part of our Freedom by Design tribe. Welcome, Josh. Welcome to Power Lead System. And uh, congratulations to Mandy, who is your actual sponsor. You're with good people. She's one of our yeah. good students that we have here. So let me see what you got for us. Um, I love those chairs where you get them. <laughs> Oh, these? <laughs> Our gaming chairs. Oh, yeah. The, these, yeah. These chairs, we got them from Staples. Yeah. Really? That's Staples, Staples is stepping up. I used to work <laughs> there. Yeah, I know. I used to. Yeah, you fired See, Josh, her. I fired my boss. Josh, she fired her. <laughs> listen, Josh, she fired her boss with a Staples pad. She literally wrote a res resignation with a Staples <laughs> pad and literally gave it to her, her boss. The irony. Isn't oh, that my awesome? God. That's awesome. The irony. That was built. Me, I, I was. I just walked. I out. wrote my my, my resignation, y'all, on the letter, and, and a Staples notepad, right? You know those long legal pads in a fifteen minute lunch break. <laughs> it was awesome. And, and, you, and, and, and what was great is I remember yeah. what you did when you fired your boss. You said, um, <laughs> "All right, guys, pizza is on me." <laughs> And you bought pizza for the whole crew. I did. I bought pizza for everybody. Because, awesome. you know, guys, when you get to this point, let me just give you guys a little insight when it happens. You know, like how that, that big day, you know, like some people feel like when it happens. Well, let me tell you what happens when it happens. When it happens, don't leave on bad terms and, and have bad, you know, burn bridges with your boss. Let me tell you something about that. Because when I walk in there now, I get nothing but 100% unequivocal respect. Like I'm like a celebrity when I walk into Staples now and they oh, yeah. see me. Every time we go there, like, I get hugs, kisses. Hey, oh my god! <laughs> then oh, you know my. my cover almost was blown too, actually, because <laughs> I had my my name tag and it had my real name Anastasia on it, <laughs> and my cover almost got blown because one of our viewers from YouTube recognized us and they're a subscriber. Don't forget to subscribe on YouTube. And they walked in and say, "Hey, Coach Ace." I'm like. Shh. Hey, hey, wait a second. Don't say that here. <laughs> I don't want them to know I'm building my, my fortune part-time, okay? 
and, and, and you know what? Um, yeah. For, for me and Best Buy, when I go back there, yeah. my my GM, she, she's wonderful. Yes. And she's still there because I just went there the other day. That's right. And, and she, you know, asked me again, like, you know, anybody, you know, they, they're always offering my job back and everything. Look at that. They want you back. And you know what's cool? Like, I really <laughs> can go back and just make extra money if I want. You could. But it's because I want to, not because I have to. And oh, my God, that is such a good it feeling. Is. I can't describe the feeling how good it feels to know yeah. that you can go back if you want to it, not because you have it's, to. it's the same thing with me like they'll go we got a short uh, shirt for you back you know yeah. back in the lunchroom if you want the shirt back you know like, yeah yeah nah and, and, like, they, <laughs> and you know what guys there's a new boss in Geek squad oh uh, man uh, I, I i i never like this guy i hope he's not watching this live but um I, i'll tell you i'm glad i'm not i have a choice I don't have to go back, right? <laughs> so it, it's just great, guys. And you guys can experience- I'm gonna answer your next question, Josh. Hang you, on. you can experience that same feeling, that same freedom if yes. you just follow the methods Good on term. understanding marketing yes. and understand the numbers and stay consistent Yes. and it'll happen. No, and the reason why I say this, Rich, is because I've seen people who fire their boss and they do it in the ugliest way. And you know what? What happens when business actually doesn't go as planned? What if a company shuts down? What if oh sales God. are down for Ooh. a couple of months? What if you Ooh. got to go back? Oh, hey, you're scaring me. I'm sorry. Don't I'm be doing, sorry. Don't be doing no, that. No, but listen, though. <laughs> it's true, though. It happened to you. Did it not? Yeah. yeah all right. Let's yeah. keep this shit real. No. It okay. To you. So back in 2010. Okay. All right. Keep coming with the questions. <laughs> uh, what happened in 2010? Um, you know, I, I met Ace, but in 2009, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, I was really breaking it in. I was, I was making six great. figures. I did it in six months. Um, and it was a uh, travel company online. And I, I built a huge organization. Yeah, I yeah. became International Diamond. Yes. I ended up traveling. I got asked to talk on stage, which was a surprise to me. And my credibility started building from there. And it was great. I had freedom. I didn't need my job. Things were great. Then all of a sudden, the, you know, the, yeah. So the owner of the company was supposed to actually add a different product in the back office. And uh, he never did, never communicated. And my whole organization, which I built um, over that time, yes. completely lost trust in the company, mm -hmm. completely just dropped off wow. in the middle of like, not even in weeks. So my income went from like 10, 20, 40, 50 to like one, two, 400, 500, 300. And then not even... Uh, a year later, the owner of the company got arrested. So uh, I had to go back to work to the same building. So I've been, I've been at Best Buy for eight years. In between, I had a little break, right? Made some money, had success, had freedom, didn't need a job. I have to go back to the same job, same boss, same. right? Because I knew that I had to create income, yeah. right? See? So that's why I tell people never, never, ever, ever, quit your job unless you're making double what you're making a month right period on. that's okay? right that's what i did and i went beyond that because yes. i could have actually i mean we did like what 42k in 15 you know weeks. 15 weeks yes and results are not typical nope. okay mm -hmm. no guarantee you can make that um and i'm going to tell you right now i still stayed another year most people would be like i'm out see ya <laughs> but i stayed another he year stayed. yeah right i've gotten coached by millionaires i've and they told me it happened to them in the past too. It's a mindset. And that it's just mm -hmm. a completely different mindset. Different mindset. Mm -hmm. But I know why I have to go back to work because I didn't listen in the beginning. Mm -hmm. Rich, build your list. I deleted I deleted my list because I was making a lot of money. And I didn't think I needed my list. Ah. Well, lesson learned. I always have a list now. I'm always making money through my list. Matter of fact, I got sales coming in from my list right now. <laughs> I can show you. Okay. <laughs> so trust me when I tell you, keep your job to fund your dreams. Yes. When you make double what you're making at work in a month, then you can actually say, you know what? I think about firing my boss. For me, I went to the extreme, so. There you have it. You have it. Best Quite advice we can ever give you guys. That is a six figure mentor tip right there. Josh says, so I am brand new to internet marketing. Now, what advice can you give me to help me grow my friends and followers? Okay, so here's the thing, Josh, First of all, I don't want you to get attached to anything that your upline told you. Let that go. Let it go. Let it go. Whatever they told Let you to do, they're wrong. Okay? Yeah. And you can tell them I said it. Because here's what I'm going to tell you to do. Create two different accounts. The one that you have right now that's your Facebook profile. Okay? That's for friends and family. There should be nothing about business on that profile. Nope. Okay? And create a separate profile with your name. You can separate it with your middle initial so that they know it's you. But brand the timeline to you. 
Okay. Brand the timeline to you. Put a little lifestyle photo on there, you know, showing that you having a good time somewhere, right? Put a little caption on that. And on top of that, put nothing in the timeline about your business. No links at all goes on this profile. You understand? Correct. And what you do is post nothing but business, marketing, educational, inspirational type content on that account and only add people that are in the niche that you are going after in your target market. Okay. You're not doing Facebook ads here. All you're doing is organic and we're the kings and queens of organic. So listen, yes, up. we are. All you got to do is grow <laughs> that puppy to 5,000. And how do you do that? It will take time. Ask Mandy about how we helped her doing it. Okay. And how organic she can go. And as far as a recommendation, five to 10 people a day also is what Adam. you should be asking. Also, Adam. And Adam, you want to add manually five to 10 people a day and put anywhere between three and five seconds of your clicks when you're adding a friend. Because Facebook's algorithm is watching you very closely. And if you go real, real fast and manually, they're going to think you're a robot and they're going to stop you and throw you in poof, Facebook jail. Yep. I do that. <laughs> so I'm giving you a good guideline to stick with. Go after people that are in your industry. And if you are a network marketer, then obviously, what would be your target market? Now, that's a good question. Mm -hmm. It's a very good question. Mm -hmm. um, what would be your target market? Mm -hmm. You want me to answer this one? I want you to answer this okay, one. Go cool. ahead. Uh, your target market would be other network marketers, but how do you find them? You find them through other leaders who are in network marketing. That's how you find them. And then you target the posts who are more engaged, right? Who are the most that are engaged? Yes. So let's give, let me give an example. Everybody knows Eric Worre. Okay. Eric Worre is like the, the big guy in network marketing, right? <laughs> yeah. Now we got what? Uh, Ray Higdon, Ray right? Ray Higdon. So why wouldn't you go on his business page? And look at the top posts who's got the highest engagement and add those as a friend because they're striving to be great like those leaders that they're going they're just drooling they're just like uh oh, I, I want that freedom i want to make that money they're making yeah and they're just true. going crazy because yeah. they can't figure it out why they don't really care they're just going to just tell you what you want to hear mm -hmm. the reality is we tell you what you need to hear to make it happen see guys when i first got started in 2008 you know what happened I actually learned through other network marketers on how online marketing works. Yes. yes. For example, let's take a let's take a flashback back to 2008. Or I actually learned from this guy called Dennis Carolera, DK for short. He's right now a consulting for multi-million dollar companies right now. Um, I learned from Maria Andros, right, who actually is an amazing marketer, which is one of my coaches right now as we speak. Yes. Um, I've also learned from um uh, mike dillard okay who also understood network marketing and things like that and he said this you have to give value on the front end to attract the right market what happens is if you don't understand attraction marketing if you don't understand how to attract a high quality prospect to you then it's gonna be very difficult for you to build a network marketing business. And that's the truth and that's the reality. Yes, that is. He made a book called Magnetic Sponsoring. Pay close attention what I am telling you, my friend, okay? Mm -hmm. Josh, please get that book, Magnetic Sponsoring. It's going to, oh my God, you're gonna, you're gonna come back to the next hot seat or you're gonna send us a message right away and say, oh my God, Thank you for sharing that book because it actually helped me understand why most people are just drowning and failing yes. because they don't understand yes. how to find the target market. They don't understand how to give value on the front end to attract the right audience in their business, right? And not only that, but he also came up with a concept. He said, get paid today, GPT, GPT. get paid today. What does that mean? That means you have to learn to earn high profits in the front end, okay? Mm -hmm. All right, and also on the back end and find out who your real, real serious prospects can be for your business. Yes. Let's look at a table. Let's say you're playing, you know, cards on a table and you're dealing out the cards, right? Everybody's holding their own hand. Who do you know who's serious right? or who's bluffing, right? Who do you know? You don't know because you need to find out by actually offering something of value and seeing who is serious about wanting to build a business successfully. So you need something generic on the front end, hence Power Lead System, right? That front end of Power Lead System is gonna track all other network marketers so they can learn exactly what marketing is really about when it comes to attracting other network marketers. Exactly. You see what I'm saying? Now, if you wanna learn how to create high ticket affiliate commissions, here's what Mike Dillard said. 
it's good to have a product that has high ticket affiliate commissions in a system, right? But why? It's because if you're trying to attract somebody into your network marketing business, what happens is when the people say no, you have no way to profit from the people who say no. Because some people already have a business. Some people don't have a business. So if some people don't have a business, some people have a business, exactly. you want to have a central location where you can sell them something that they need, right? Or really what they want. Right. Versus and then, right. And then as you give them what they want, because what they want is that freedom. What they want is to learn how to build their business, not your business, their business. That's you right. see, now you have a real business, like Mike Diller said, you have a real business. A real business is earning profits. It's not trying to track someone and getting no, 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 no. It's more about trying to find people who are looking for help to try to build their business. On top of that, you're building your business. And now you have what we call a real profitable business. Right. And I like what Jeffrey Combs says. And he says, some of y'all building a nonprofit organization from the comfort of your own home. Yes. <laughs> Yeah, and he's a veteran it's network true. marketer. Yeah. It's so true for those that are in network marketing. You guys know what I'm talking about. You feel like you're building a nonprofit right. organization from the company. Josh, you might home. have Josh, you might have to listen to that again. <laughs> but I want you to understand that yes. we're here for you. You're a team member now, you're yes. in good hands. And uh what I'm gonna recommend that you start doing is two things. You start building your list and you start communicating and building a relationship with your list yes. and start making profit and learn from the people you know, learn to uh, accept, you know, get profits right. from the ones who say no. Exactly. Once you understand that concept, you could always build your network marketing business on the back end. And guess what? On the back end of your central location, of your nice, sweet, funded proposal like Power Release System, right? Or other high ticket affiliate marketings in the back end, guess what? You can make high profits so you can stay in business to keep building your passionate business. Does that make sense? I, this is my forte. Yeah. I can go out about oh, gosh, this. Yeah, GPT like, man, for the longest time. Totally. Okay. Um, they need the name of the book and the author. So let me go and grab that. Go for them. grab that, and, and we'll put and it we'll on there for you. The next yeah. Question. Good question, Josh. Good question, Josh. Uh, let's see, Mandy. Let's Ooh, see, please. Ace and Rich. Josh has been love, uh, loving learning so far, and he is on his way to his first sale. And Woo! only a week in, he is hungry, and we are taking him to the top. Yeah, baby. Woo! All right, Josh. That's right. Give me that rocket of desire, baby. Straight to the moon. Shoot to the moon, baby. That's what I'm talking about. We're going to be sharing a lot more content, a lot more information, a lot more value, a lot more training. Um, this is what we do. So you understand. I learned this a long time ago, 2008. And I'm going to tell you something right now. I kept learning it out throughout the years and I never forgot it. And the more I kept studying it, the more it started making more sense. I'm like, oh my God. Oh, and, and Josh, one more thing. Do you know also what Mike Diller said? He said that um, network marketing is a leaky bucket. Okay. Now guys, all of you huddle with me. I just posted it there. There you go. Okay, mm -hmm. guys, I want you to come closer together. Come closer. Huddle. Come on. I want you to huddle with bring me. It in, bring it in. Okay. Bring it in. Yeah. Marketing is like a leaky bucket. Yes, I said it. Mm -hmm. For all you guys doing Amazon, for all you guys doing Etsy, for all you guys doing eBay, it's a leaky bucket. Do you know why? Because you're you know, you're scrounging to earn tiny commissions. Mm -hmm. And you need a huge volume. Right. Okay? And it's a lot harder to keep people in business because there's different reasons why they don't stick around. Mm -hmm. We've built a organization literally since 2016, in multiple, I, I don't, I, I lost track. I, I know it's all like over 7,000. Yeah. Right. The people in the beginning that we brought in, they're all gone. They're all gone. Mm -hmm. Some people stay, but majority are all gone. So how can me and Ace stay in business for so many years? How? Because we learned the value of high ticket affiliate marketing. Okay. And Josh, if you have any questions on high ticket affiliate marketing, shoot me personally. Okay. Rich, not Ace, Rich. Yeah. And I'll get together with you and I'll share something with you that will take your business to a whole new level to earn high ticket commission and learn the right 
marketing education. So that way you can actually build your own list so you can control your own business. Because the problem is everybody's building a list in somebody else's business. Yeah. Hence, if you are part of a network marketing business, even let's say, um, I don't know, um, Jeunesse, because we were in Jeunesse a long time ago. Yeah, yeah. Okay. When you use their pages and their products, mm -hmm. those emails and that information is going to their list, their not customers. your list. That's your their list. customers. Exactly. So that means you have no control of your business. Mm -mm. Okay. You want to take control of your business by building. This is the number one lesson I learned when I lost it all and had to go back to work. Always, always build your own list because it will be your number one most valuable asset. And when it's your most valuable asset, you can always create your own economy with your own list. Exactly. Because the name of the game in this business is to build your own economy. And the network marketing companies, the network marketing owners, mm -hmm. and the actual people who get paid mm -hmm. into going into network marketing, stay tuned, I'm about to let you know that one too, mm -hmm. huddle, okay? What happens is, when you start actually building your own list and you could promote any offer that you want, right. that means you're wide open to take control, 100% control of your own business. That's right. You get me? You feel me? You guys getting it? Now, here's the problem. The problem is the network marketing leaders, this is what they do. They get bought into different companies. Mm -hmm. See, I know the inside because I got, right. I got offers. Okay. They offered me and they want to pay me money. They've I've, I've flown out. I've been flown out to companies because of my credibility. And I'm going to tell you right now, they will pay you. If you can build a downline right. and you are a veteran of a network marketing stature, they will pay you to actually bring your organization or build your own organization. Right. They will pay you and put you at the top because the people at the top make the most money. That's why network marketing it's a hard road and it's a hard game. It's hard. You yeah. need to make sure, like Mike Diller said, yeah. you need to make sure that you do not become a victim of that leaky bucket syndrome. You got to work smart. Because when you have a leaky bucket, yeah. as you're trying to build your network marketing business, That's right. right? What happens is people are coming in, they're falling out faster than staying. That's right. So how could you, how could you build a, sustain, a sustainable income? You can't. You can't. No. It's impossible. Mm -mm. It's only possible if you've been a veteran network marketer for years and you have other leaders yeah. who understand network marketing, okay, to bring them over to another company and then hop to another company, hop to another company and keep making money and, and show flashy checks on stage and, you can only and say, so much. oh my God, I did that in a few months. No, you, no. You, you already had a downline. Exactly. So it's misleading for a lot of people. It is. Okay. Absolutely. So I want to tell you right now, the way to make big money in this industry mm -hmm. is to earn big money. There's no other way around, about it. No. Okay. Don't let anybody tell you any different because they're lying to you. Yeah. You're going to struggle and you're going to fall for the facade of the education teaching you, Hey, I can teach you like, you know, how to do Etsy, or I can teach you how to do e-commerce. Do you know how those guys are making money? They're making money by actually teaching you how to do it. That's it. Because they know it's a hard road. They know. They know the majority of people are not going to see, you know, succeed with that. Right. So they'll get paid with the information marketing. Exactly. Exactly. All right? exactly. So how do you make money? Right. You make money by building your own list, controlling your own business mm -hmm. by building your own list and having a high ticket on the back end. Right. So you can sustain your business to keep building your list to make more profits so that we can sustain your business and be free. That's the only way you're going to do it. Why? I've tried everything under the sun. And the only thing that's ever worked for me is actually sustaining myself in a high ticket affiliate marketing business. Give us some likes, comments, okay? and shares on that. So if man. you have any yeah. questions that's on right. what I am talking about when it comes to high ticket mm -hmm. affiliate marketing, yes. and guys, if you're watching this on YouTube, I'm gonna tell you right now, mm -hmm. click on that link, freeprofitformula.com. Put your email in there, watch our presentation and watch our story that Ace did on that page and get started for $1 trial when it comes to learning what marketing is really all about. And you're gonna learn the truth. Enough bullshit, enough BS already in this industry. Yeah. You start learning the truth of how to really sustain yourself and really fire your boss. That's right. Because we were able to fire our bosses from learning from freeprofitformula.com. That's right. Put your email in there, watch that presentation. I'm keeping it real. Watch that presentation, watch our story. 
Find the mentor who taught us exactly how to sustain our lives and be free on the internet 100% without no jobs. And have the car I've always wanted, a Chevy Camaro 2SS 1LE LE. track vehicle. Yeah. I mean, come on. Sweet. Right? I got other ideas. Now, next year, I'm getting her a vehicle. Like, I, I already got, I'm already saving for her vehicle now. Yes. And guess what? Her vehicle is not going to be alone. It's going to be paid outright. Why? Because of high ticket commissions, high ticket affiliate commissions, high big profits. You need to invest in your advertising. How can you invest in your advertising when you get a small, tiny commission? You can't. What gives? So and you need a huge volume of people right. to actually earn one big commission to advertise. Now, we all know Facebook, Google, those advertising platforms have gone off, you know, gone up in cost when it comes to advertising. You need to play the game properly. Don't let anybody fool you and tell you that it's possible doing it the other way with trying to earn tiny commissions. Ain't nobody got time for that. Mm -mm. All right. So with that being said, another question. Let's go. <laughs> Bam, baby. That was awesome. Guys, I'm telling you, all you got to do is basically take what we are giving you and just like soak it up. Soak it up like a sponge. I think Adam this month has done what? 5K, Adam? From what you learned from us? Is it 5K? Five, I, I do believe it's 5K. Four or 5K, right? Give me give me a, uh, an answer in there, Adam, what you've done so far this month from learning what we taught you. And I'll go here and take take a look at some questions here. And Sean Jones just joined us here on hey, live. Hey, Sean Jones. Hey, man, jump in on the huddle. Welcome to the live. Hope you caught some right. of that. Me. Let me go over here. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on, hold on. I'm going to show you right now, guys. You got it? That's the place you want to go to right there. That's the place you want to go to. Let me uh, go back to the Facebook. There you go. I'm sharing you guys the goods. That's right. I'm sharing the truth with you, and I'm being totally 100% transparent. I've been a part of multiple companies over the years. I've been a part of network marketing. I've been a part of like, I even tried e-commerce. I've sold on eBay. I've sold like on, sure <laughs> on Amazon. Yeah. I've sold like... I've sold in so many different places. Oh my um, God. Yep. Okay. And the only thing that has saved my butt <laughs> from not ever having to work again is earning a high profit margin, period. And Adam Shelton, thank you for your transparency. From our mentorship and what we taught him, he's earned already 5K this month. Woo! Congratulations, man. Woo! Oh my God. <laughs> but you know what? You know what? You ain't going to find no live on the internet like this. Mm -mm. Right? Not with a community like this. When we all come together, we huddle and we talk. Absolutely. Because it's all about us. It's not about me. It's not about Ace. No. It's not about Adam. It's about us. That's what right. can we do together as a collaborative effort yes. so we can all work together and help each other That's grow? Right. Isn't that the way it's supposed to be? That's isn't right. the way? Isn't that the way we're supposed to be working together? Exactly. That's how things get done. I'm sick and tired of everybody saying, I want to help you. I've made this much money. And then all of a sudden, guess what? You still left hung out to dry. And then all of a Bullshit. sudden, you don't even know how to <laughs> be a marketer. That's right. You don't even know how to actually earn income. Mm -hmm. And that's the problem. Mm -hmm. That's the problem in this industry. Well, guess what? Ace and Rich are changing the game. Yes, we are. We are creating an army, right. literally an army of people that actually are going to be transparent and are going to care and are going to show people exactly how they can fire their boss That's and right. really make things happen in the industry. And when you ask them, man, where'd you learn all this stuff? They're going to tell you my mentor and coach is Ace, Ace and, and Rich. Rich. DeMarco says, wow, Adam Shelton, 5K in one month? Question mark, Adam. There you go. And DeMarco, you're next. There you go. You're next. Mike Scudero says that shit was deep. That's right. You just gotta <laughs> when, when we have coaching sessions and you yes. when I when I teach you stuff, when I when I do just do what I tell you to do. Do it. That's right. Because for example, what did Adam do? Adam listened to everything I had to say. And Adam's already to 5K this month. There you go. And that's and, just this and, month. And we have a meeting tonight, me and Adam. There you go. I have more coaching. Yeah. I have more stuff to share with him. So it's all about earning. Right? Earning, earning, earning. But you can't earn unless you learn. Hey, Rich. What? I see another uh, six-figure earner on our hands. I sure do. That's right. There we go. I'm sorry for all the ones who left from the very beginning in 2016 because your stupid asses didn't realize that it took a little work, didn't it? <clears throat> oh, boy. Right? 
See, that's the thing. Everybody wants it. Like, you know, they, 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 they come online. They're like, I want to make money, but they don't want to listen to what I got to say. But the people that listen to what I got to say, they make money. Yeah. I, it's, it's really that simple. Yeah. It's not that it you doesn't know? work. Is that you ain't working. Yeah. <laughs> And you I gotta, get, hey, hey, I don't have my hat on, but <laughs> I gotta get my hats off to Misha Wilson. I, I'm just gonna be real. Thank you, Misha, because Misha taught us a lot of different things Absolutely. when it comes to internet marketing that we didn't understand. That's right. That's right. So I give my hats off. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. But see, here's the thing. the The strength here is how it's the message is relayed. Yes. And what I can do is I can relay a message in a way that no one else can. That's right. That's I know how right. to keep it very simple yes. to the point that people can actually obtain it and understand it and take action and start getting results. But only the people who actually listen to what I have to say. And Adam today, eight sales so far today. Awesome, Adam. Congratulations on that. I remember He's about to earn. when he couldn't get generate leads he no he came to us like, and he was like i don't know what to do totally i'm learning all this stuff i'm blind. confused i'm overwhelmed blind. what do i need to do yes. i said i got a plan for you let's go he said let them be sight and he definitely can see <laughs> i have more we made the man see <laughs> but listen adam i have more sites to show you this evening there so. you go <laughs> I love having fun. Yeah, Misha Wilson, great this? mentor. You guys yeah. enjoy not see? Definitely let us know in the live and the chat that you guys are enjoying this and getting great value. And those of you who are watching this live on YouTube or watching the replay, let us know yep. how you're getting great value from this. And Mark and, and Dana, comment below. Mark and Dana, you're next. Yeah. You're next. Okay, you're next. Ida says, Listen to what I got to say. I love Ace and Rich's integrity plus the way you coach and the way you teach. Yeah, it's true. Nobody actually teaches the way we, no. we have our own signature style. No. Um, people can try to copy it and everything, but you guys know when somebody's you know feeding you a load of BS and you know when it's real or not. That's right. <laughs> you can tell right, right away. So uh, what we got here. Hey, we don't get asked to talk on stage and mentor people for nothing. No, we don't. Okay. Yeah. I'm telling you right now, we help people grow. That is our strength. And that is what we do. This is this is who Ace and Rich is. It's not about like Ace and Rich. Okay, Ace and Rich, uh, we're, uh -uh. we are we already made money. We're free. That's right. What about you? Exactly. Don't you want freedom? Isn't yes. it your turn? Because in my opinion, I truly know that you deserve mm -hmm. to have that freedom. But here's a problem. There's a paradigm problem, right? Yeah. There's a paradigm shift happening. You need to shift to that new paradigm. And that new paradigm is where success freedom, abundance, and love is waiting for you. But the problem is you're stuck over here in the old paradigm and you're not ready to break it. You know what you need to do? It's time for the break. You see it. the scissors right here, y'all? You need to cut that paradigm like this. You understand? Let go of the umbilical cord. And, and, and yeah, guys, go. and I, I'm just going to be real Seriously. with you. It is not easy. Mm -mm. It is not easy because it's got you like this. It's got you like this holding you. That's right. Hold, getting a grip on you because you got that old paradigm, old ways of thinking. It's like glue. It's like yeah. you're just stuck in a and certain way. And just like way. Adam said, you know, he always keeps his cup empty. He actually broke the cup. <laughs> he, no, no, he broke the cup. He broke the cup. He broke but the cup. But you have to keep your, you know, you have to keep your cup empty. You ha you can't think you can do this all on your own because you got to have the right people that you're connected with and actually show you the way. If you don't have the right people showing you the way and you know who they are, you've been in the, in the business, you've been through the gauntlet, you've been trying and trying and trying and, you know, and nothing's happening. So, how much more trying do you can you do before you realize that shit? I'm doing everything they told me, but I'm not getting any results. What else do I need to do? I need exactly. to go talk to somebody. I need to go talk to Ace and Rich. Exactly. That's, That's right. what you need to do because we'll put you on the right track. Yep, exactly. And, um, and you know, and, and why not yeah. give you the actual direction? Exactly. The resource mm -hmm. where the information came from. Yep. Mark and Dana says, Ace, hey, what's up? Uh, we're 35 from hitting a thousand friends on our Facebook page. Woo! Awesome. Cool. Awesome. And awesome. I know I know we talked a little bit about some paid marketing. Ninja code. And we got to get you guys <laughs> on that paid marketing uh, strategy as well Ninja. to get you guys moving. Yeah. Uh, Higino Rodriguez, that's me. Very stuck. Uh, Higino, if you're stuck, do something about it. Send us a message. Let's find out what we can do to get you unstuck. All right. That's what this hot seat is all about. That's right, Eugenio. Okay. Reach out to us. And if you're serious, yes. reach out to us. Absolutely. Stop being stuck. Listen, how, how much further are we from the end of the year? You have to take that consideration. Business is measured by quarters. I, so you have to think about this. If you still stuck since January, since January, time for you to cut the umbilical cord and yep. change things before it ends this year. Because here's the thing. This year, 
you plant your seeds, you plant them right. You nurture them until they grow. You can't bear fruit and you can't grow a tree unless you water it. So if you're not doing the right activities, and we talked a little bit about this yes, yesterday, if you don't put the activities in place into the right things to do, okay, come next year, you're not going to harvest. And that's the way we look at things when we build oh, online yes, businesses as digital yes. marketers. It's you reap what you sow. Yep. And if your seeds are not planted in the, in the right way, pattern, whatever, if you don't have this going, <laughs> I got news for you. While the top earners are reaping what they saw would come 2020, you still going to be planting. You know what? Um, <laughs> I, 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 I'm, I'm going to go on a limb here, mm -hmm. but I'm telling you, reach out to us. We'll get you going in six months. Um, let's see. Eric says, um, he said, the old paradigm is a parasite. I love that. Oh, yeah. I love that. It's so true. The old paradigm is a parasite. Parasite. Because if you think about it, you know what? I I, I want to read. It's poison. I'm going to read. You guys want to. <laughs> you guys want me to read my email to you? I would love to read an email oh, that I put that out today. Oh, that would be awesome. I mean, it's up to you guys. You guys want to check it out. We stay here a little bit longer. We usually stay here till six. But uh, what time is it? Today's one of those days. Today's one of those days, guys. Yeah, How about we're it? gonna spend a little more time with you. How about it? Let's throw some likes and hearts up there. We want to stay a little bit longer, and then Rich is gonna give you guys an awesome look inside behind the scenes of one of our emails. Yeah, matter of fact, I'm just gonna read it out. I'm not gonna. I don't need to share the screen. You got it. Um, you gonna on. read it out loud? Yep, that's right. So, and uh, you know, I I do write third party for um, Ace, just to let you know. So, if you guys want to know, so the title, guys, is the last sunset. And here's what I said in the email: I discovered something so important. That is, that that is what was always right underneath my fingertips. This was always underneath my fingertips. You see, everyone is always looking for the keys to the kingdom, but never had any direction. Sometimes we do things and don't know why we do it, but we must be consciously aware of what is happening. Just like this email, are you really aware what this email can mean for you? I know this email means change action results. The sun sets for all of us. But in our lives, we are, we are, uh, we are, we're only, am I messing up my own words? We were only, we are only going to see so many sunsets until we see the last one. What am I saying here? Time is your most valuable asset. What will you do with it? We will determine your path. Will you just exist? Or will you choose to live and break free? Have a great day. That email has gotten such an amazing response. I can't even tell you. Literally. So the whole premise of that is, guys, we all literally have the same sunset. We all have the same sunset, right? Don't we? How many sunsets are we going to see in our lifetime? But there's going to come a time that we're going to see one last sunset. Yeah, it's so true. What are you doing yeah. right now mm -hmm. to change that? You know, it brings me back when you say that, metaphorically speaking, uh, everybody ever watched the movie Black Panther? You remember in the ending with the enemy, right? The uh, Jordan, remember? Yeah. OK, so what happened was Michael B. Jordan came out at the end. Right. And he said, I always wanted I want to see in Wakanda the sunset. He said, I heard yeah. it was the most beautiful thing. And right before he took his last breath. Right. Because the king. Right. Actually killed him. And he said, you know what? To honor that, I'm going to let you see that last sunset before you die. And he brought him to the cliff yeah. and he actually let him see the last sunset. And then he passed away. Yeah. That's what when I when I think about that email, I think about that. And I'm like, whoa, that's deep. That's so yeah. deep. That's so, rem so deep. So remember the first line of the yes. email that I said. Yes. I discovered something so important that was right always underneath my fingertips. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. How important is that? Yes. See, sometimes we have things that are right underneath us that we just don't see. And we just miss it. Do you know why? Because the old paradigm puts a shadow right in front of us that we can't see opportunity at all. All we can see is pessimism. All we can see is negativity. All we can see is our own thoughts sabotaging ourselves from success. 
Okay, we're going we're going uh, we got a comment coming in and at the same time Okay. Uh we have somebody here um that is a fan of the hot seat, not only that but is actually one of our coaching clients who's actually wants to, us to say something about her and put her accountability out there because she just realized she's about to have a breakthrough. Are you guys ready for this? This is one of our clients. Raina Kahanui says, okay, okay, you know what? This ain't called hot seat for nothing. I'm done hiding. I'm stuck in my old ways. I know this shit works, but I also know I am the problem. This is me being transparent. And I'm so freaking frustrated, but I'm ashamed of saying it. But you know what's great about that, though? And then Raina says, but you know what? I got the right coaches and the right systems and the wrong ass mindset. And I'm dying over here because I'm stuck. You know, um, the fact that she could actually come out publicly like that. Yes. Which I thank you for that. Thank and, you um, for being honest. Yeah. That, that It takes a lot to really come out and say. A lot say, of courage. Yeah. Yes. But what I'm going to say to you is. When you actually acknowledge yourself, and, mm -hmm. and we talked about this in the past, you know, a, a lot in the hot seat. We have. When you acknowledge yourself and you realize that you are stuck for a reason, right. that means you just had a conversation with yourself. That means you just had a breakthrough. Right. And that breakthrough is so important for you to enter the new paradigm. That's right. And what you just did right now, you just entered the new paradigm. And you know why? Because remember how we discussed about the comfort zone? Raina, remember we talked about it's like layers of an onion. You just basically peered the last layer. So yeah. you just stepped out your comfort zone. You came out transparent. You humbled yourself and you said, you know what? I realize I am the problem and I want everybody to see this, that I am just like everybody else. I am going through this right now. And no matter what I buy, no matter what I sell, no matter what I try to do as far as marketing, no matter how many books I read, no matter how much videos I watch, I still am stuck. Now, what Raina just said mm -hmm. is solidifies and relates to that first line in my email. Yes. I said, I discovered something so important that was always right underneath my fingertips. That's right. You see, it was always right underneath your fingertips, there but you're goes. now, you're discovering it right now. You're getting there. And that's huge. So listen up, Raina. You've got to take action, my dear, and stop overthinking things or else you will never be able to change your circumstance and you will remain stuck. The only time things are going to change is when you start changing this. Yes. DeMarco says, big up, Serena. Yes. Thank you, DeMarco. Awesome. Uh, this is you guys. Best hot seat you have done up to date. Well, thank you, Adam. Thank you, Adam. <laughs> Tracy Lee says, the ninja, the ninja. Well, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, let's see I, I get fired up sometimes, guys, because yes. I, I I love this industry, but I know that people out there give the industry a bad name, yes. and it's because they don't think about the value; they, they just think about the you know the pocketbook and stuff like that. Exactly. So. Mandy says, "I have been crushing it, and thanks to Ace and Rich and the coaching, I am getting results, and I will get to the top." You're on your way, baby. You're on your way. Tracy, said, Tracy Lee says, "Guys, I hit 1,181 friends on my Facebook page. Woohoo! Awesome." But Tracy Lee, I'm gonna keep it real. We gotta get that paid marketing going. Oh yeah, we definitely gotta get that going. Yes, you got the audience, but now you gotta start getting the other stuff going. That's right. Yes. Uh, let me see here. Looking at other other comments here, so they're just commenting and praising Raina. So Raina, you got some uh, praises and ups over you here. Know, this is what I love yeah. about this community. Mm -hmm. Everybody is there to lift each other up. Yes, isn't that the way it's supposed to be? See that, Raina? Right? Yeah. With a community, with more than one human, mm -hmm. we can move mountains. Alone, we we perish. That's right. Right. Absolutely. So this is what it's all about, and you're witnessing it right here in the live. Josh McDade says, oh, my God, I love you guys. I'm so glad I'm with this team. Well, you know, you can definitely feel it, don't you, Josh? You feel the difference in, as far as energy and vibration in our community compared to what you've been accustomed to in the past. That right there tells you you are on the right path. That's right. You're in the right place at the right time. David Toomey says to Raina, Raina, thank you for your humility. Lioness Leo. <laughs> Okay, Eric David Douglason says, okay, here's my question again, <laughs> second time. How do you use share screen on StreamYard? I can't tell if I'm using it correctly. Okay, so what I can do is, I'm gonna have to move my cam. You guys might get a little dizzy here, but this will be the last question of the evening. Yes. Um, so let me go, go here. So here we are, let me see, is this one here? So as you can see right here, um, you can, our secrets, <gasps> right? <laughs> so right here, so now you can see 
that this is StreamYard, okay? Mm -hmm. This is StreamYard, guys. So what you do is you head right over here to where it says share screen. Now it's gonna ask you which one. Right. Which one do we choose? And of course- I have a separate monitor and yeah. it does my share screen. I click on that and automatically there's a share screen right there. That's how simple it is. It's right there. And then I'm gonna stop it and I'm gonna share. I'm gonna stop it, then I'm gonna share. It's right there, share screen, that little button right there. See right there? I'm circling right there. There you go. Cool. And just make sure, because Rich didn't cover this part, when you see the big square and it's highlighted in blue all the way to the right, that is the icon to let you see the full screen of your screen share. So that way you are out of the window. But if you want to see yourself, the little icons at the bottom shows a silhouette of a man or the little little man in you know the icon. That means you are going to be in picture frame. So if you yeah. see it full screen and you saw that without the picture frame, that means you will be out of it. But you can always bring yourself into it or out of it. Correct. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Okay, so now I Adam's like, I got 10 sales now. Awesome, Adam. Congratulations. <laughs> All right, Adam. Woo! Adam's crushing it. Oh my uh, goodness. George Jolly, I understand uh, Urena and because where I am where you are at and I have been there for a while now. I think it's because there are some things that I have not fulfilled in my personal life. I am not currently working on my industry because I got, hold on, see more, got punched in the gut during the recession and got discouraged and not taking action to get back in the field because of unresolved issues. I am not moving forward in my business as I should. I do something, but not enough. Here's the thing, Joyce. This is, this is my, my realm. I know how you feel because when I lost my six figure income, mm -hmm. when I lost my freedom, oh my when I lost having to go back to work and then having to be well homeless for a while first, mm -hmm. had no idea what I was going to do. I just had belief and that belief carried me. And if you could build that belief up again, guys, and you could just it, let it carry you because that belief yes. can carry you through the yes. toughest darkest times Absolutely. you know just like we've been through okay um like i said when you guys go to freeprofitformula.com you'll hear that story in that presentation uh we went through the darkest times in our lives uh you know drug addicts threatening our, our, our lives um you know stole my laptop um you know living with a heroin addict like it, it just and, and unexpectedly too we didn't even know uh it, it was just a really bad dark time in our lives um, but now, uh, rest assured, we're we're happy, we're 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 blessed, and, th and things are fantastic. That's why we never forget where we come from. When we look at someone who's on our chat, who is watching a video right here on YouTube, watching a video here on Facebook, we look at you because we know that you're real. We know that you know that we understand where you come from. We understand the problems. We understand because we've gone through the darkest times in our lives. Okay, so we can relate when you're feeling like, I know I should be doing something, but I'm not doing something. That's when we come in because yes. we know and we yes. understand how that feels. Absolutely. Okay. Yes. So guys, with that being said, we love you. We appreciate you. We want to thank you so much for being on the hot seat today. My name is Rich Guzman. And my name is Anastasia Holders, a.k.a. Coach Ace. Don't forget, guys, if you're watching us on the live, be sure to click the notification bell so you don't... We don't, you don't miss a beat when we go live and we upload new content here on YouTube. And for those of you who are watching the live right now in our Facebook community, right inside AR Freedom by Design, I posted a link to our YouTube channel. So that way you guys can actually click and subscribe to our YouTube channel. So you have access to more information that is not available on this fan page. So you definitely want to do that. Exactly. And Josh, send us a message. Like I said, if you're serious, you want to you know change things, send us a message. Anybody here that's watching this live, watching the replay, send us a message. We'll get together. We'll form a plan and get you guys going. And let's let's get something going in six months. Forget about waiting for next year. Yeah. Let's get you going go. in six months. Let's go. Okay? Come on. <laughs> All right. Thank you so All much. Guys. Have a great weekend. Okay. Have fun. All yeah. Right? Enjoy. Take care, guys. Love you. Appreciate you. Bye. Bye. -bye.